What's up everyone and welcome back to Ratchet and Clank going commando. I know it's been about a year since I last recorded this quite literally actually I, I don't think I've said that before but it's almost been a year I know I started this up around Christmas time last year so hey look at that isn't that appropriate because it's snowing in this level just like it's snowing in a lot of places now so I have uh, now obviously upgraded to the Ratchet and Clank HD collection so uh, I'm gonna put the fact that it some somewhere I'll put the fact that it is the HD collection so people will know the difference. But uh, going back into this game, I actually don't have a lot of the like stuff that I had in the previous playthrough because I had to start all over. Uh, so here's the weapons that I do have: the Blitz dude isn't upgraded all the way, Pulse rifle I haven't even used yet, and this one not really that upgraded. But I'm gonna buy the mini turret because I don't know I never used the mini turret actually. So. Yeah, let's get started today on Planet Siberius here. I don't know how I'm going to start doing the episodes, actually. I think I'm just going to do um, longer videos, but have a whole video. Or, sorry, a whole episode. Oh, gosh. Oh, have a whole um, planet in one episode, even if it's longer. I think that's how I was doing it anyway. So, anyway, uh, let's go ahead and get started. I know that this game... Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Calm down, dudes. These are... This is not nice. Um, I don't really remember a lot of this game, to be honest. Uh, but I will try my best to remember most of it because I have been playing through number one uh, in the whoa It's snowman Dan Hey snowman Dan you get a skill point for killing him. I remember him. It's a nice guy You get to play as him in uh, in Ratchet and Clank 3 and uh, of course this is on ps3 So we got nice achievements or trophies or whatever they're called in this game So there we go. We get ourselves a nice little achievement and the more the merrier right so let's kill them all by the way, I do have the shock upgrade on this thing, because I actually got upgrades now, unlike before, where I wouldn't get any upgrades apparently. So, over here we got some more of these arachnophobic guys, I don't know what they're called, I think they're MS, MSR or something? MSR for robot, I think? Machine Spider Robot, I think that's, actually I, I'm not, I wouldn't be surprised if that's somehow what it is. Uh, but anyway, uh, there is supposed to be hmm, something around here, I think. Uh, is it down there? I'm not really sure. I'm gonna risk it all to lose it all, aren't I? I don't know, but I'm gonna go down to this roof and it's probably gonna not end up being that good. Come on, just make it to the roof. Yeah! Alright, I made it. That's pretty great. Um, is there a secret back here? I have a feeling that there is a gold bolt somewhere around here. Not gold bolt, platinum bolt. There it is. How's it going, bro? My name is... I have no hand, apparently. Um... Okay, that's a uh, that's a nice glitch you got there, Ratchet. That was pretty good. But there's a platinum bolt, so go ahead and grab that. And uh, I boo 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 boo. I do believe we can just hop back over down here and get back to where we we're supposed to be. So let's shoot some dudes over that way. Oh gosh, this is not going too well. Blitzgun, help me! Oh gosh, I meant to shoot them over there, but I guess that didn't really work out. That it it did work out in the end. Because we blew them up. So, go ahead and grab your tractor beam and bring this little platform over into the elevator. Come on, get in. Get in there. No! Dang it, I meant to... See, I was trying to get it in before me, but didn't really work out, did it? I don't know. I really miss playing this game, though. I can't believe... I don't know. I guess it's just because of viewership I stopped playing it on my channel. But I really enjoy playing it, regardless of the views. So, I'm going to keep doing this, even even if people don't watch it, you know? Because uh, it's a... I don't know, it's just a game of my childhood and I really like it. So anyway, uh, this platform here, we want to bring it to, I believe, all the way back over here. I think so. And then when you got it here, use the super jump. I don't remember what that's called, but it lets you get over here to another platinum bolt. And that's just the two that are in this level. So that's kind of easy to get, not really too hard. And yeah, I'm still doing this 100%. Because 100% is the only way to go, apparently. So we got Snowman Dan, we got all the stuff. I'm not going to do Spiegel points, though. So I guess technically it's not 100%. So you know what? If you wanted to see 100 100%, then this is not the right place to be. Sorry, bro. Alright, let's go over here. Kill these dudes. That didn't even shock this one. Oh, gosh, what is that? Oh. For some reason, I thought that was something a lot more destroying than just a dude. I don't know. It was an airship, so I thought it would attack me. But it didn't, so that's good. Was there a bomb glove in this game? I totally don't remember. I think there is, but I probably... Oh yeah, there's the nuking thing. Uh, the mini nuke. I don't remember what it's called, but... 
Uh, I have it upgraded all the way, so I'm not using it at the moment. Let's, uh, Blitzgun, you're not really doing too much, are you? Nope, three hits on these guys to kill them. That's pretty miserable. But hey, we get the upgrade now, so got the double cannon, the bl double blitz cannon, because now it has two heads. And everyone knows two heads are better than one, so we're going to blow these guys all up with our blitz power. Ooh, look at that. That is pretty powerful. Okay, are we si still fighting these dudes? Come on. Is there actually, hmm, I think this might be where the first boss is. I don't really remember, but I think it might just be, uh, unless we've already fought a boss, in which case I wouldn't remember what it is, because uh, I'm dumb. All right, look at that. We got another, whoa, I'm down there, buddy. These TNTs ain't blowing me up tonight. Yep, this is, uh, I do remember this level. It's the the big old truck level. I don't actually remember it, but I'm going to put the, um, the mini turret thing there and the pulse rifle there because I haven't been using them at all, so it's time to start using them. And we don't have a cutscene, but uh, yeah, the HD collection is really, really nice looking. I don't know if you guys can tell, but I'm going to try to upload this in as high quality as I can. I don't think I'll be doing 1080p because I'm actually not able to record it at that um, at this moment in time, but apparently I shouldn't have gone out of the swing shot because we need that right here, so let's go ahead and, oh no, that's, alright, sorry mini turret, didn't mean to do that to you bro, okay, got a bunch of these dudes, I don't know why I'm using this gun, but, oh gosh, oh gosh, there we go, um, you guys are really annoying, I'm just gonna run past you, you don't even give any experience, you give like nothing, oh gosh, not literally nothing, you give something, but not enough for my viewing pleasure, but you guys do, even though I'm actually not using a gun that I currently need to upgrade. Probably should do that. Oh no, I've been shot, but there's a bunch of health everywhere, so... Oh yeah, look, this is where the first dude boss is. This guy, I forgot his name. He's something thief. He's a something... something guy. Oh, whoa, that's not... Am I just supposed to run past you, dude? I'm not really sure. No, I can't use that. Alright, well, I'll use this. Here, have a taste of my singed flip. That's not really the singe flip. The singe flip uh, is a very complicated maneuver that can only be pulled off by the Agents of Doom. Those are from the first game, actually, so maybe not. But I want to blow you guys up, because uh, I don't know what else to do. Go. Okay. Hey, more of these guys! I did not expect that. My nanotech has just been upgraded, so everyone blows up in a flurry of action. I don't know how much nanotech I'm at. Actually, I don't remember also how much nanotech I was at when I first did this game. But now we're at this much nanotech. Oh gosh, I thought I would fall there. That wouldn't have been very good, would it? Um, and apparently I don't have a weapon there, so maybe I'll go put one there, I guess. Oh, I guess I did have the swing shot there already. Oh well. Let's put the dynamo. Because the dynamo is... Bananamo. Bananamo? I don't know. I guess that's my username, combined with, uh, bananas. I gotta dodge these things. I've been failing to dodge them recently. Oh! We got him. And apparently the truck flipped over. Cool stuff. This is a pretty big truck. Just realized that. But yeah, I think this is when the first boss comes up, and it is indeed that dude. We gotta fight him again, and find out his secret identity, because so far he's hidden himself from society, wanting to be a reject of the world. He has concealed himself behind a mask, much like the Spider-Man, I guess, even though Spider-Man is a friendly neighborhood. It's not actually a neighborhood. He's the friendly neighborhood Spider-Man, is what I meant to say. Alright, so we're going to go this way. Um, well, there is really no other way to go, but we got some crates with some nice free ammo for us. Thank you, crates. I really appreciate this. And still not enough money for the Synthenoid, which is what I believe I had in the previous playthrough, so... Oh well, we're gonna go ahead and fight this dude. Probably should actually buy some Seeker gun ammo, because it's probably the best weapon to fight this dude. Let's go! Fight the boss! Ha! You've lost, Megacorp! Take your imperialistic eco-fascism to another dimension! Say goodbye to your franken best! Come on, Frank! Too slow, you corporate lackey! Oh boy, we're too slow for him! So we're gonna avoid his little laser crap and shoot him with our seeker gun, because that's 
I feel is the easiest way to get him, considering that the Seeker gun has a lock-on feature without you actually having to buy the lock-on upgrade, so... I don't know, I feel like it's a pretty good gun. Oh, dodge the laser, Ratchet, because its power level's really over 9,000. That wasn't good. Anyway, uh, what is up with this dude? I don't even know. I do remember what is up, but I'm not going to spoil anything just yet. I'll let the cutscene coming up spoil it for you. Oh god, he has turrets. Well, that's not good. I gotta break these turrets if I want to survive the action-packed bananas. Oh gosh, okay. Well, let's turn this back on and uh, actually use him against him. Oh no, I almost fell out of the ring, but I killed him too, so that's good. You had us worried for a moment. Do you suppose we should stop him? Not worth it. We got what we came for. Let's just get that little guy back to Mr. Fizzwidget. Ratchet? Spank? Is that you? We've accomplished our mission, sir. The experiment is safe and in our possession. <gasps> Why, that's cutaneous! Absolutely munificent! You two are a galopsious team! We were glad to assist, sir. We just need coordinates to our next rendezvous point. Of course. I'm on my way to give a tour of Megacorp's historical mining site. Here's a little pack talk on the fragility. I really need to start learning these new Megacorp, words. Megacorp, manufacturing and mining. A tireless drum major leading the galaxy on its march of progress. Come tour our desert mining facility and see why our most precious product is our history. When we first arrived, we found a planet completely overrun by rainforest. To better accommodate the local wildlife, we transformed this impassable jungle into an easily navigable desert. Ever the technological pioneer, Megacorp invented the automated management team, thereby eliminating costly upward mobility. And all the while, making your life richer. Megacorp Manufacturing and Mining. Our march continues to the tune of progress and profitability. Call Investor Relations today. I will do that. Is that facility still operational, sir? Alas, no, but it's steeped in hysterics. I've offloaded the condiments to your naval computer. We'll see you there. See you guys next time.